Good afternoon, everybody, and happy Monday to you. This is your market update for April 24th. Stock market opening higher this morning with the Dow leading the way up 25 points at the open. Uh, currently, Dow is up about 52 points on the day. S&P 500 up one. Uh, NASDAQ, unfortunately, down 41 points on the day uh, due to some concerns in regards to corporate earnings reports in the tech sector. We'll see how that unfolds throughout the course of the week. Mortgage-backed securities started off the day down two basis points, and we're up at one point um, as much as 14 basis points. Currently this afternoon, up five basis points. So still trading in a very tight range, but still staying above that key level of support, which is the 50-day moving average, uh, which I mentioned is, uh, is very important moving forward because staying above that level of support gives room for uh, more improvement in interest rates, especially with all the news that's coming out this week and the potential for hopefully some additional improvement in mortgage rates, especially with the um, PCE report that comes out on Friday. That's the Personal Consumer Expenditures Report, which is the key measure of inflation that the Federal Reserve looks at very strongly when making decisions moving forward on monetary policy. I'm hoping that the PCE report will kind of follow suit with the CPI and PPI report that we saw a couple weeks ago, uh, continuing to support that inflation is cooling. Um, if that happens, we could expect, depending upon how much, uh, you know, what the numbers show and how much inflation appears to be cooling, we could expect some additional improvement in mortgage rates. So we'll keep a close eye on that. Other key reports coming out this week. Uh, tomorrow, we've got the uh, couple of home price index reports that are coming out, as well as new home, new home sales numbers. On Wednesday, we've got mortgage application data and durable good orders. Uh, Thursday is the first uh, Q1 GDP report, the gross domestic product report. Um, as well as initial jobless claims and pending home sales. And again, of course, on Friday, the big hitter PCE, which we're looking at very closely. We'll continue to keep you updated throughout the course of the week. I hope you all have a great afternoon and I will see you tomorrow.